Hey everyone, I just got something in the mail and I was like, oh man, I haven't done a video in forever. And I wanna do a YouTube video. So I was like, well, why not do an unboxing? We all love unboxings, at least I do. And so I thought I would unbox the Summer Fab Fit Fun Box, which just showed up in my mailbox today. If you're not subscribed to Fab Fit Fun, you should totally subscribe it's awesome you get four boxes a year um it's probably one of the more expensive boxes but typically they have really cool things in them we'll see what this one has um yeah i really like fab fit fun i'll drop a link down below but obviously this video is not sponsored because i have not enough youtube followers so if you find me um moderately amusing please subscribe all right, so we're gonna just uh, cut this open without cutting off my hand. Uh, so this one is in support of Global Gift Foundation, um, which is sponsored by Eva Longoria. I like her. Um, so I don't know if I uploaded this, but a while ago, FabFitFun tried to do like a paper version of this and I hated it. Um, I really like the magazine version. I think it's much classier and much nicer. So this has all the information about all the products. So if I have a question, we'll look in here. Um, right off the bat, there are some coupons. Uh, this is a FabFitFun. Um, oh, hey, I can give this to a friend. So if you want this, drop a comment in the comment box and I will send you $15 off of your first FabFitFun box. Um, yeah, so let me know if you want this, I will send it to you. Uh, first comment wins. All right, and then of course, HelloFresh. Would you guys know Eric and I did HelloFresh? We really liked it. Um, it was nice, but we don't, our schedules are so crazy busy all the time that we cannot expect to know how many meals we're actually going to eat at home. Um, so we decided not to do that. We were kind of wasting money. Um, so, but here's an $80 gift card, $20 off of your first four deliveries. First person to comment, um, on this one for this one, we'll also get it. Um, and you guys have to be subscribed too okay thanks all right let's open this up oh it's so pretty as always i love these boxes um so right off the bat i see something that is typically in here and that is a really large piece of cloth um whether it's a towel or a shawl there's always something big like this which can be nice i have a lot of um beach towels now that I don't really use though. So that's a little um, iffy, but we just got kittens. So I've actually found a use for them, which is probably horrifying to the FabFitFun people. I'll never be sponsored now. Um, I, we don't take beach towels to the beach because we live in Oregon. And if you guys have been to the Oregon beach, it's not really a beach towel-y beach. It's like a bundle up and wear a windbreaker beach so we take our beach chairs this is a really soft towel though I might change my mind huh I'm gonna open this really quick um I don't typically like soft towels because they don't typically um dry as well I feel oh it's round too I am is it no it's not I'm I'm lying it's like oh it's like flower shaped it's got little petals that's cool uh, so it is kind of round, um, but also kind of not. I love oddly shaped towels. This will be really nice to lay out on the grass with Amelia. We just got her a slip and slide. And guys, I cannot wait for her to discover the world of water on a hot summer's day. I was like, I'm going to go set that up today. And then today was like, I'm going to be 66 degrees. And I was like, where's summer? <sighs> All right. Uh, exfoliating foot mask. I am obsessed with feet um, and mostly mine not being gross. So I'm excited to try this. I've not tried this brand before. This is by uh, Wish Beauty, but there is an extra H in this Wish. So it's W-H-I-S-H, Beauty. Um, 
Yeah, coconut milk and verbena. Mm, I bet it smells good. Let's check it out. I don't really know why they make footstuffs smell. Um, ooh, it smells good. I like it. Okay. Um, spray all day. This is a hydrating rose spray. And uh-oh, it looks like, oh no. It looks like it got, it leaked a little bit. We'll see. Um, mist five sprays onto face with eyes closed before or after makeup. Reapply throughout the day. Caution, discontinue, okay. No. Avoid direct contact with eyes. For something that you're supposed to spray on your eye. Oh, it smells rosy. So this is just a hydrating facial spray. Hmm. I'm not good about facial sprays, guys. You guys, for those of you who know me, you know that I'm not great at like moisturizer or any sort of that. Like I'm lucky if I remember to take off my makeup before I go to sleep at night. Um, all right. This is Generation Clay. This is a brightening, purifying clay mask. The one great thing about FabFitFun is I'm always getting beauty product, products that I wanted to try that I just haven't gone out and bought for one reason or another. Do you guys like the Sherlock Holmes music in the background? It's like, it's a mystery. I don't know if you can hear that actually. Um, okay, so I, every once in a while, uh, if I go out of town especially, I take a bunch of products with me because I'm like, I'm on vacation, I'm gonna do vacation-y things, and I do a lot of masks because masks are easy. You put them on and you can just watch TV or read or whatever, and they're great for vacation time. I don't always have the time to do that at home because mostly, honestly, I just wanna sleep at home. So I'm excited to try this. Um, yeah, and this is by Generations, I think. Ultraviolet, I'm sorry. Ultraviolet? I don't know who this is by. Generation Skin. There we go. Um, now we all know why I'm really not sponsored. This is a mystery choice. I never go on and pick my own mystery because, or pick the stuff that's in my back box because I want it to be a surprise. I have regretted that every time because I've always gone in here and looked and been like, oh, I could have gotten that. Oh, man. Okay, so this is a cleansing oil. So I don't know. Can you guys see that? I'll put it up. It's like separated. So if I give it a little shake, it starts to come together. Ooh, and it's pretty. Um, vigorously shake bottle, moisten cotton pad, gently spread over face in circular motion. Oh, it's for makeup. Okay, so guys, if you don't know this, use oil when you're removing your makeup. I like coconut oil. This is a specially def um, special oil that people, that this company um, made. This is Skin & Co. Um, I like removing my makeup with oil. It takes much less time um, and there's not a bunch of harsh chemicals in it. Um, so yeah, I usually use coconut oil. Recently I've been using baby wipes because I have a baby and uh, I haven't bought coconut oil. Um, this has a bunch of extra ingredients, but the first ingredient is water. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna try this out next time I wear makeup. Maybe I'll make a video of me taking it off using this. This is truffle therapy cleansing oil. So um, I will let you know what I think of that. Uh, this is Kula makeup setting spray. I have Urban K's, um, what is it? All night long makeup setting spray that I really, really like. It smells a little funky though, I'm not gonna lie. I don't really care for the smell of that one. So I am definitely excited to try this. I love makeup setting spray. If you didn't know this, you can put setting spray on your face before you do your makeup. If you've run out of, this is a really nice bottle. Um, if you've run out of like primer and it will really help your face um, in putting that um, foundation onto your face. I wanna smell this though. 
just has a so it has SPF in it SPF 30 and it does smell a little summery and by summery I mean like sunscreeny um, not like oil sunscreeny though like expensive sunscreen <laughs> um, oily sunscreen I mean okay I have been skipping this bag but I'm gonna open it I love jewelry and I'm pretty sure this is jewelry although you wouldn't be able to tell by looking at me because I rarely wear any um, I'm not even wearing my wedding ring right now I just realized oh cute this is just a little necklace and it has little stars on it that's really cute um kind of cheap jewelry contact with water sweat lotions and perfumes may tarnish the jewelry but cute uh we'll go of course go over the prices for all of these things at the end of the video uh oh hair bands these are the non-tangle ones i think i really like my regular hair bands but let's try this out right now i'm gonna just pull this it's like those key do you guys know what i'm talking about those key rings and then you can slip it over your hand okay so we're gonna just put up my hair so it's supposed to be non-slick slippery but guys i have kind of thick hair I mean, not currently, not since having a baby. Um, but I don't feel like it gets tight enough. Well, maybe. Okay, I don't feel like I should keep my hair like that, though, because that was not a very good hairstyle. Um, okay, I can see that these, yeah, see, this is already stretching out. I'm not sure what I think of this. Uh, yeah. Okay, and then last product in this box is by... 111 skin or 11 skin or triple one skin i'm not sure how they want um their product or their name said this is the rose gold brightening facial treatment mask um so of course it's a mask i love masks again when i'm traveling a lot just because i feel like when you're traveling you just need extra skincare anyway because you're kind of doing things you don't normally do Skin mask comes in a little thing like this. This is a really pretty packaging. I love this color. It's like a pinky purple. Since having my daughter, I've noticed that I don't hate pink as much as I used to. Not bright pink. I'm still not a fan of that, but uh, yeah. Okay, so let's open up the magazine really quick and we're gonna go through the prices of these things. Um, just because I like to kind of go over what we got twice and give final thoughts. So, if I can find the prices. Okay, they totally changed everything. Ah, I don't like the new magazine. Okay, so they used to have like one page with all of the things on it. And I'm not finding the one page with all of the things on it. Now everybody has their own advertisement page. Okay. All right, well, we'll start at the beginning. Sorry, this is gonna take longer than expected. Uh, so first off, to start off, these boxes are $35 each. $35 each? Something like that. Um, yeah, this says $35.99, but that could be with the $15 off. Um, and this box is valued at $269.95 up to $467.95. So it, it can be a very um, expensive box depending on what you get. So to start off with, these um, Kula Organic, oh, I'm sorry, I'm looking at the wrong thing right now. Hold up. Okay. So, um, other people got a mini traveling blow dryer. I did not get that. Um, I did get the towel though. That was this towel, super soft. This towel is valued at $50. I would not pay $50 for a towel, but I am cheap. Um, 
Then let's see, there was some um, Brazilian cream and shower moisturizing gel that I didn't get. Um, a kimono that I didn't get. This um, brightening facial treatment mask is valued at $160. Again, I'm not gonna pay that much. Um, there are some bowls that I didn't get, a diamond tote that I didn't get, a felt leather board that I didn't get, um, resistant bands that I didn't get. I did get the double strand star necklace, which is right here. This is valued at $50. So this necklace and that towel are valued at the same cost. Um, there were silicone wine glasses that I didn't get. Um, liquid eyeliner that I didn't get, uh, nourishing styling cream that I needed but I didn't get. I did get the mystery item that was this. Um, and it just says could be up to $24. Um, next page. Um, so there was the setting spray. I really like this bottle, guys. Um, this is valued at $36, and I feel like that's probably right on Target. I don't remember how much my Urban Decay makeup setting spray was. I just expect makeup to be expensive, like anything to do with makeup anymore. Um, Intelligent Nutrition's Redefining Micro Polish. I did not get that. Um, there was a duo pack that I didn't get. I did get the Urban Clay, um, and this is valued at $39. The Exfoliating Foot Mask is valued at $32. So, final thoughts. My final thoughts are, I love boxes like this. And the reason that I love it is I always get things that I would never get myself. Um, Eric says it's just a waste of money. And if you guys know my husband, you know he's a little left brainy. And if you don't know what left brainy is, please go watch Jeannie, I believe her last name is Robins Robinson. Is that right? Anyway, just search for left brain um, and she'll come up in YouTube. She is hilarious. Um, anyway, so my husband, everything has to have a purpose and, and a reason and stuff and he'll do anything to save a buck. So he's not a fan of this particular box, but I like it. I like to try new things. I'm excited to try this face mask, um, this uh, makeup remover. I'm excited about it all. Um, so I love boxes like this. However, I will say that I think the items inside the box are greatly overvalued, okay? So um, maybe if you are a millionaire, you buy $50 towels, but for me, everyday Jane, who grew up poor shopping at Walmart, I'm not paying $50 for a towel. I don't care how soft the towel is. It's a towel, it doesn't need to be $50. Um, and you know, I'm probably not gonna pay $160 for face masks and by I'm probably not going to, I definitely will not be. Uh, there are only five face masks in here. So that's, I mean, that's a huge uh, amount per face mask. That's insane. Um, that's like $25 a face mask, over $25 a face mask. Oh my word, that's like $45 a face mask, is that right? That's insane. Okay, um, just like I said, greatly overvalued. So I think probably a better, um, a better way to say this would be, you know, I got maybe $100 worth of stuff for $35. So um, I don't, you know, you have to decide for yourself, speaking of uh, left brain, uh, you have to decide for yourself if you feel like that's valuable. I like it, I enjoy making videos, unboxing things, and I enjoy trying out new things. Um, so yeah, I'm just really excited about this. I hope you enjoyed this YouTube video. If you did, uh, please hit that like button, please subscribe, please drop a comment if you want some of these um, coupons. And um, I will see you guys, you know, later.